Now, there are so many books out there, so many resources that teach the proper agile methodology, how to do it, how to work in it, and all the positive benefits of it. That is not in the scope of this topic. I'm going to show you guys the agile environment through the eyes of a software automation engineer so that you guys can understand what I do at work on a daily basis. But one thing that I do want you guys to take out of this is that waterfall methodology is dying. It's a dying art and it's getting replaced with agile. Now, some people may have problems with it, but a lot of companies are moving in that direction. And it's not because they're stupid. Most companies wouldn't be moving that into that direction if they thought it was a mistake. Most companies are moving into that direction because it's a much more effective way of developing software. So do keep that in mind because it's very important that you do go and learn what agile environment is and how it happens there. But I will give you a glimpse into what an automation engineer does there. So to do that, let me pull up the spreadsheet. Now, the spreadsheet is a week by week planner that I'm going to discuss with you guys. But before we get into that, let me quickly mention the goal of quality assurance, right? We want to deliver a product to our customer that is bug free, that functions as they wanted in as little time as possible because the faster it comes out to the user, the faster we can get their opinion on it, the faster we can make it better for them. And also, obviously, the faster something comes out, that means the less time it takes and the less money it costs. And the customer is happier. So keep that in mind. Now, let's imagine that we're working on this amazing website called qtptutorial.net. One of the best out. Just kidding with you guys. But anyways, this is the website. And let's imagine that I am your customer and you guys are my software automation engineers. And this is the website that I want. And I am giving you guys specifications, also known as requirements, about what I want from this website. And in the next sprint, I want you guys to develop two features. Well, technically, I'm not gonna tell you how long that, guy, that takes. I'm going to tell you that I want two features developed. I want to have a sign up page where if you click on the sign up link, it takes you to a sign up page. And I also want a feature that users can register for free by clicking a button that allows them to register for free. And then all they have to do is enter their username, email, and so on. And that's it. So with that knowledge, let's imagine that we show up to our job, or I should say you guys, as I'm the client, you guys show up to your job on the first week of work. 